Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to more Jack 2. Last time we helped out Vin uh, power up this elevator to the Baron's Palace. Now we are going to go to the Baron's Palace and kick Praxis' ass. And by that, mean, I, by that I mean we're going to kill him. So that's the Baron's Palace, this big thing in the middle. This is one of the old support elevators and now we have to get to the palace. Which is actually going to be pretty difficult, so get ready. It's very easy to die here. I remember dying here many times as a kid. I expect to die here many times today. So here we go. There we go. There we go. Can't stand on that, so we're gonna stand up here. I can only imagine how high the winds would be up here. Like, we should be being pushed off real quick. Ow. Auto lock, please work. Okay, I was gonna say, please auto lock. All right. Don't know why this is considered practical. And that didn't work. Alright, I keep getting shot by those turrets, but as long as they keep giving me health, I guess it won't matter. So let's go this way. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Okay, that was a little bit way, that was way closer, cl closer than I thought it would be. Way too close for comfort as, as well. So let's go this way. We're doing pretty good. Okay, this one's a little bit different. You just gotta jump to the side. Might freak you out at first when you don't see what to jump onto, but there you go. Okay, this part's just fun. So you can duck under these. Okay, you can't duck under these. <laughs> okay, you gotta jump over these. Whoops. I was thinking about a different part, maybe. There we go. And look at that. Easy. I did get hit once, though, which is a shame. A real shame. So this should be the Baron's Palace. So the metalhead can talk, which we know from the beginning of the game. So there's the Baron again. Damn. No. Strength is their weakness. We play helpless. We train them to eat from our hands. And then... Move forward with a plan. Tell Edwin to up her patrol. I want that tomb found. The tomb? But your daughter has not been agreeable. <laughs> I'll see to that problem. One way or another. Oh, great. So Ashlyn's the daughter. daughter. And find that child. If you'd spend half as much time looking for the little brat as you spent flirting with that mechanic girl, we would have pinned his royal ass to a wall long ago. As you wish. With enough persuasion, I'm sure our spy. What was that? How do you hear us? We're on the ce- How many of you people hear when something happens on the ceiling? That makes no sense to me. Well, whatever. They didn't actually see us, so we're fine. Let's just go this way and this way and this way. And yeah, they actually did see us. Oh, we have a rat in the wall, do we? A rat and his boys. Back for a few more dark eco treatments. Will allow me to put you both out of your misery. Alright everybody, welcome to the boss fight with Baron Praxis. So, to beat him, shoot a ship. It's very simple. Uh, his weapons are going to be a little bit annoying to deal with at first, but just dodge and shoot. That's all I can tell you. Dodge and shoot. Oh, darn it. I didn't dodge the, in the right time that time. Okay, when he's up there, make sure you shoot him. That that thing recharges his gun, so it's kind of scary. Okay. Roll nope, didn't roll the right way again. In this part, I would say roll jump since you have so much space. There we go. And yeah, I'm dead. Sorry, guys. I got at a really bad angle there. Oh, wow, Jack. That was a death. That was dramatic as hell. All right, so let's do it for real this time. This time I have full health, so should make it a little bit easier. Yeah. Oh, thank you, wall. Thank you, wall. I couldn't see. All right, whatever. I can make this work. Shoot the Baron. Let's go this way. Okay, he's out of bullets, so he's going to go recharge now. 
Okay, I'm starting to notice this auto lock's not working. There we go. Oh, crap. Okay, do you hit by that? You know what? Let me just do this. This move. Oh, crap. That's why I don't do that move. I'm out of ammo. And collecting ammo almost got me killed. All right. Jack, you're not shooting the Baron. You're shooting at the ceiling for some reason. I swear, guys. The, I swear. The PS2 version aims at the Baron better. This is just not working. We'll be fine, though. We'll figure it out. Please tell me there's health over here. There's definitely no health. All right. So here we go again. New mission time. New area means new boss and or new type of weapon. Okay, he's got torpedoes now or something. Missiles. Yeah, he's got missiles. Okay, let's just keep rolling. You gotta go keep rolling, rolling, rolling. Okay, he's out of charge, so now he's got to recharge. Okay, while he recharges, we might as well recharge. get him get a few shots in his ass and we got him again one stage one stage left but we do not have enough health for this stage because this is the hardest one so here we go okay fire twisters get ready for fire twisters no i don't know why they're fire twisters but that's his weapon all right there's some maybe some health over here oh my god there's no health anywhere nope nope not letting you hit me Okay, that hit him. Okay, got him a few times there. No, nope, not getting hit by his fire twisters. Okay, he tried to do a charge attack on us. I, I like that his machine is like a squid, but at the same time, it, I fear it. I fear the squid. Okay, he's using his charge attack again. Okay, let's get some of this. I need to get him back on screen before he tries to charge me. He's going for flame tornadoes. Wait, what's that crate? Please tell me this is health. It is, thank God. Okay, we have a chance now. Got him! Okay, phew! Okay, one death on the Baron isn't too bad. Two deaths hurts, but no, we're not going for three. Oh my God, I could have used my dark powers. All right, so we kicked the Baron's ass. That's pretty good. It was, a, it was a fight. I'll admit, it was a fight. He gave us a good one. The first stage seemed to be the most annoying. The third stage... Well, the third stage is the most annoying, but the first stage was pretty tough. Middle stage was the easiest. That's Precursor Orb. I'm taking that. So we came to the palace to kill the Baron. That didn't end up happening. The Baron was able to escape. So we'll have to use one of these elevators to get back out of there. Ow. Whoops. Hit my head there. Uh, always check behind the consoles. There might be a precursor orb. Hey, just a big recommendation from me. Access granted. Never seen one. There's a big statue of the Baron. Because he's got a big old ego. And now we got to go to the sword. So, Torn. What's going on, man? The Baron knew we were there. It was weird. Like, maybe he hurt, <clears throat> maybe he hurt us, but that seems a little bit awkward. I feel like we were pretty quiet. And I feel like if he did hear us, it, 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 it just seems impossible. It seems impossible that he heard us. So maybe you know what happened. What are we going to do? Let me just do this real quick. Turn this car around. And get back to fighting the Baron. Out of my way. Excuse me, don't want to hit the cop. The cop will kill me. Or at least try. Let's go this way. Yep, you can go up here. And I hit a cop. But as long as I don't go down from up here, there's nothing they can do to me. But it would take longer, so screw that. Let's go down here. Alright, there's no way the cop's gonna stop us. Torn's place is, like, right around the corner, so I'm not worried. Excuse me. Bye. Out of the way. Uh, I can't make this turn. Out of the way, lady! Oh, no! Ah, no! I've killed two women. There's nothing I can do to make up for that. All right, excuse me, pardon me, out of the way. Torn, we almost killed the bear by ourselves. It was pretty cool. 
Wait, who the hell is that? Oh, I remember that guy. Young man with light hair, blue tunic, and a rabbit. I'm pretty sure he has light green hair. Uh, I guess it's kind of bluish. Look, we climbed up to the Baron's palace and we tripped a few alarms. Oh, right, that too. Like, I didn't authorize a strike on the. Hey, we kicked the Baron's ass. That's right. Fortunately, he escaped. And we overheard a secret meeting with the leader of the Metalheads. You saw the Metalhead meeting? No, he was on some communicator. Mm. But we heard him talking with Baron Praxis. The Baron is bribing the metalheads with Eco. <laughs> it will never be enough. But the Baron's gonna double cross him. Is that so? Well, our good Baron's wonderful charm must have angered someone, because there's word from the wasteland that metalhead armies are on the move again. Oh crap! Why you tell me Ashland was Praxis's daughter. What's your connection with her? That's none of your business. Since you've stirred up the wump beast nest. You and Whiskers here get to move four of our people to new safe houses. Shuttle each agent to a location they specify. Move all this of like concept art. casualties. Don't screw this up, Jack. All right, so we got to go save four people because four resi or yeah, four freaking underground members are in danger now because of us. It is our fault. We did go on the attack the Baron, so now he's being way harsher on us. So let's pick up these guys. All you have to do is stop right next to them. Their AI will get them in the car. Sometimes. Alright, these guys all have voice actors. I don't know how good they are. Yeah. Oh, crap. The guards are coming after us now. Yes, the guards know who we are. So, this is going to be kind of problematic. Let's uh, get him into... The yes, go to your safe house. They give you a lot of time for the first guy. Alright, we're going to go this way now. Luckily, we're driving a pretty tanky car, so I don't think the cops are going to be able to stop us. Make a hard right here. Hey, you, get in. All right, where do we go? Okay, to the right. Out of the way. Excuse me, copper. Okay, hard left. Uh, this car can't make hard left. Yikes. The turrets are back. Oh, crap, that turret still hit me. Took a lot of damage. The car's are, Our big tanky car is smoking. Luckily, I can always just switch cars, but first things first, let's get this guy to safety. Yep, 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 hitting the uh, invisible terrain because we're on a hover car. This darn tanky zoomer. Oh, wow, that cop's dead. Yeah, that cop flew. Right? I'm good. Alright, so that guy's happy we're on his side. I'm happy we're on this side, too. The Baron side seems to be full of jerks. Jerks that try to use machines to win while we use our bare hands and guns. Alright, so you. I don't know who you are, but get in. Is he in? He's in. Alright, let's uh let's be let's be a little bit careful. If the car blows up with one of your allies in it, you lose the mission immediately. So be careful. You don't want to instantly lose the mission. I, I always recommend going on low hover on this mission. Only high hover when you have to, like now. There we go. Alright. Got him. Got him. You're safe now. Thanks for the pick. No worry. Alright, last guy. Let's go get him. I like the design of this one. This one's cool. I like the, the space in the middle. I just killed a man. <laughs> but he wasn't a resistance member or uh an underground member, so it doesn't matter. This is where we escaped from the Baron in the very beginning of the game, and we went when we came out the trash chute. Let's go ahead and get this last resistance member. Get in. Let's go. Right, let's go. Out of the way, coppers. There's no way you're gonna stop or me. All right, going left. This guy, I remember the fourth one always being the farthest and being the hardest. Because, yeah, he lives in the water area, or at least his new hideout's in the water area. And that means I need to hover high, which means that the cop cars can blow me up a lot easier. It's, pro it's a problem. See? He tried to blow me up there. Alright. Oh, I almost blew myself up. Whoopsie doodle. And... Oh my god, this car's flaming. Get out. Okay, we did it. Saved him. Screw it. 
Now I guess we just need to wait. Yeah. All right, new mission. Now that all the underground members are safe, the cops mysteriously forget your face and they will not be after you anymore. Um, well, they're after me right now, but wait till we get a, another mission started. It'll be fine. Hello, cop. Bye-bye, cop. All right, let's go right. That's good. That's good. We're doing some good turns here. Blew up my own car, but it's it's worth it. It's worth it when a car spawns on the other side, like that one. That one was supposed to be there earlier, but it wasn't. So I'm going to take that car now. Oh, excuse me, copper. Don't want to accidentally kill you. And then a hard right. Yeah, there we go. See, we're getting good at this. All right, we did what you wanted. Everyone's safe. Praise us. Scouts report movement in Dead Town. Creatures moving toward the sacred site, just as before. What happened uh, before? Metalheads broke through the old city wall. We fought them, but then the Baron pulled back, leaving everyone outside the new barrier to die. Only the Shadow State somehow stopped the attack. And now you expect us to go out there again? You catch on fast. If you prevent the Metalheads from reaching the sacred site, the Shadow will be most grateful. So the shadow repelled an entire metalhead attack? Probably wasting this. Yeah, the Vulcan barrel. Shooter of yours. Believe me. You're going to need it. All right, we now have the third gun in the game. The this thing is like a light machine gun. It's amazing. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. And of course, since this gun's all colorful, or this game's all colorful, it's our blue gun. The Vulcan barrel is a high-powered machine gun. Uh, so we need to go back to the old sacred site and protect it from the metalheads that are going to try and break in. Because apparently the metalheads will break through the old city barrier. And if they do that, then we're all doomed. I don't even want to know. Like, if the metalheads get into this city, all these NPCs are dead. And I know I'm supposed to care about that, but I just want to see them fight, fight them. Alright, Daxter, that's a machine gun. I don't really think your little furry body can handle it. But if it can, good for you. All right, let's go left. Let's go right. Ah, yeah, no, no, no. Okay, don't bump around too much. And I hit a cop. I just barely tapped him. He can get back up and wa walk it off. I'm trying to protect you people. Metalheads are on the rise. I need to protect you. I'm the city savior. Look at this big gun. Look at the weight to it. And this gun transforms. Look at that. It's just too cool. Oh, yeah, metalheads have invaded. Okay, they're here already. That should let you know that we are being invaded right now by the metalheads. Because this place used to be just creatures. Regular ones. And now the creatures are done. Are gone. I think the metalheads ate them. Alright, we came to this mission with not full health. Probably a bad idea. We'll figure that out later. Got it. There we go. Got it. I like using the Vulcan gun. Oh, those metalheads. Those boys are... Those are the big boys. The tall ones are the scary ones, guys. Okay, I fell into the water. Oh, it's not water. Yeah, those tall ones are pretty freaking powerful. They can take hits and still do deal damage while being shot. And they can take a lot of hits, so I have to use my spin attack on them. I recommend using the blue gun on them. I just didn't have mine out, so I didn't do it. Okay, that looks like two more of them. Do you see how tall they are? Look at that. All right, let's see. Can I hit them? There you go. Damn it, that one survived. Yeah, the machine gun does a lot of damage, but you gotta be careful. There we go. Oh my god, there's still more. Oh my crap. I'm using every gun today. I'm gonna need them all. This mission asks everything of you. Okay, these guys, they're a little bit... They're not the worst. They're not the hardest guys to fight. Oh man, the metal head's gone. Or the skull jump's gone. There we go. Three three scatter gun shots got him. Okay. Oh, these guys are tough too. These guys are real tough. Ah, oh, damn it. Yeah, I recommend killing them quickly and then getting into cover. Pro 
problem is I'm already low on health. So if I run into another one of those guys, I'm probably gonna die. Okay, just a regular enemy, I can take him. Okay, a lot more than one. Still think I can take him. Scatter gun with this much. Oh crap, 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 there's another one. Oh crap, there's one in the background. No, I got stuck on the freaking environment. Daxter, don't! Oh, Daxter, he's dead too. Yeah, the mission restarts you all the way back if you die. It's insane. But this time I'm starting the mission with full health, so maybe I can do it. There we go. Takes three shots from this gun. One if you do that. <laughs> Damn. Excuse me. Just in case. Oh shit, I pissed him off too early. I hit the wrong guy. There we go. These lanky ones are a little bit tough. There we go. One jump, two jump, three jump, four. I, I do recommend this strat. Alright, that should do it. Yep. I don't know the exact amount you need, but that works. The little ones, I always recommend the red gun. The scatter gun's always good. Okay, I'm not going to get his gem again. Alright. There we go. Alright, this guy, this time I'm going to start over here. There we go. Shoot your gun. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, whatever. I already took damage. Okay, so I'm out of blue gun. And there we go. The Vulcan is back to full. Alright, my, my Vulcan's good. Okay, whatever, that worked. Ah, darn it, I was in the wall. Damn, the Vulcan kept him in the air. That's how strong this gun is. So this is as far as we've ever gone. All right, these guys aren't too tough. A couple of them, though. They got a horde. Small horde, but a horde. All right, got them. It's more like a squad. We found a squad of them. There's one over here, too, though. You the last one? Oh, crap, no! Oh, damn it! No! Holy crap, they just kept coming. And I couldn't see them. No, I'm already down to one hit. Is there anything to heal me? Oh, no. Alright. Snipe them from here. Alright, got him. Please tell me those were the last ones, because I'm, like, dead. Oh, that was it. We did it. We had one health left. Is that... Is that... No, it couldn't be. That's not... It's... Same old as... That's right, everybody. But what? How? When? Where? Why? We're in the future, Dax. This horrible place is our world. This world is the Jack-1 universe. It's just the Jack-1 universe in the future. Somehow, Samos' hut stays uh, stay standing. But we are still in the future. Let's go back to the city. Oh. Alright, I just killed myself. Luckily, the mission is complete, so don't worry. Uh, let's try that again, but this time, let's actually do it. Ow! Ow! Damn, there's no invincibility frames. Alright, let's go up here. Pardon me. Alright, there we go. We did it. So now that we've done all that, we're going to go back to the city. And we need to figure out what the hell is going on. Because we just found out we're in the future. Haven City is Sandover Village. Haven City is Sandover Village from the in the future. 
So overpopulation definitely kicked in and a bunch of a bunch of other crap as well. But you know what guys, that's going to be it. I want to thank you all for watching. Next time we'll figure out how the hell we came to the future. What the hell we're going to do here? And are we going to go to that? Are we going to go get a new dark power maybe? We're definitely going to do that. We'll do that next time. So I want to thank you all for watching and goodbye.